Want a dessert that looks beautiful, impressive, and serves a crowd, but isn't too hard to make? This English trifle, submitted by All Recipes member Terry Sutton, is your answer. First, we'll prep the fruit. Have and slice two pints of fresh strawberries, about an eighth to a quarter of an inch thick. Then sprinkle them with a quarter cup of granulated sugar and toss to coat. Now slice bananas about a third to half of an inch thick. Toss them with a quarter cup of orange juice so they don't turn brown. Whisk together two cups of milk and a three and a half ounce package of instant vanilla pudding mix until it thickens. Cut two eight or nine inch layers of white cake into one inch cubes. If the cakes are homemade, make sure they're fully cooled before you cut them. Several All Recipes members also note that they streamline the recipes by using store-bought angel food or pound cake. Next, we're ready to put the trifle together. Put half of the cake cubes in the bottom of a large glass bowl or a trifle dish if you have one. Add half of the strawberries in an even layer. Next, add half a pint of fresh blueberries. And half of the sliced bananas. Spread half of the pudding over the fruit. Now repeat each of the layers in the same order. Cake, strawberries, blueberries, banana, and pudding. Next, in a medium bowl, whip one cup of heavy cream to stiff peaks with an electric mixer. Have the cream in the bowl ice cold to help the whipping. Spread the cream over the trifle. Finally, garnish it with a quarter cup of blanched slivered almonds. and a dozen maraschino cherries. All Recipes member Terry points out that you can put together the English trifle in a large glass bowl, or you can make it in individual glasses. Either way, the bands of fresh fruit and berries, vanilla pudding, and cake cubes make a stunning presentation.